Hello Virgo, welcome to my channel. This is going to be um, for the mid to end of July. I love reading for all Virgo placements, Sun, Moon, Rising, as well as Venus, Mercury, and Mars. My website and my emails in the box, Bill, get your own reading from me. Let's go ahead and see what we have for mid to end of July, shall we? Let's see Virgo. I hope you all are having a great day. Okay. Let's see what's going on for my lovely Virgos. I know you guys know I love reading for you, right? Let go control issues, okay? Keep an open mind, all right? Keep an open mind, Virgo. Your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectation. Mm, I'm getting right away there could be like um, an income problem. There could be like a... A situation in which maybe somebody makes less money or maybe somebody doesn't really have time to date is what I'm getting. Uh, that's a very detailed message. That's what I'm getting as soon as I pull the cards. That's what I'm getting here, okay? Like perhaps because of work issues, they're not um, able to actually come forward at this time. Uh, but very soon very soon they will okay because they're very attracted to you all right soulmate perfect okay so for a lot of you the person that is on your mind right now is a soulmate okay that's why they're they are a soulmate beautiful beautiful combo there let's pull some cards and see what's going on okay well, we have the devil card popped out. That's Capricorn. <laughs> the Capricorn card popped out. Okay. So this person could be this person could be obsessed, Virgo. All right. This person could definitely be obsessed with you. Uh, that's for sure. All right. That is for sure. Could be some obsession there. Uh, also could be a Leo. So this person is trying to find the strength to come forward towards you is what I get. Let's see some more cards here. Nine of Wands. All right. Ooh, got a whole bunch of cards fell out, Virgo. The Fool, King of Swords, the Hierophant. Okay, this, so this definitely, this definitely feels like another Earth sign, okay? If this is an Earth sign... Um, this person is obsessed with you, okay? I wouldn't be surprised if they um, pop in at your workplace or they drive by where you live or they ask um, your friends about you. I, I really would not be surprised, okay? Because this person has very strong feelings for you, all right? But it could be border it could be borderline obsessive okay or a little bit toxic in your opinion if you think that it doesn't have to be but yeah it could be borderline a little bit obsessive okay so be careful of that now let's see what's going down between you and this person we have a queen of pentacles yeah so in in their eyes you are the queen of pentacles okay regardless of gender you know you are like the earth uh the earth queen or the earth king okay Four of, cu uh, four of Pentacles. I almost said Four of Cups, so Four of Pentacles. Okay, there could have been a missed opportunity. All right. So I feel like this person wants to come back around. Exactly. Wheel of Fortune. The Hierophant reversed. So we had the Hierophant twice. So in the rare case, there could have been a divorce or split up in the past for some of you that resonate. Yeah, so this person wants to come back around. Now, will they? Who knows? But they do want to come back around, okay? They certainly do. And we have the Wheel of Fortune again. Wow. Wow, Virgo. Okay, so we have the Wheel of Fortune twice. And we have the Hierophant twice. So clearly this person is feeling very lucky that they have you. Very lucky that they even have your number is what I'm getting. Like, maybe you're out of this person's league. Like maybe you are, okay? And this person knows that, that that's for someone out here. Like this person thinks that you're you're out of their league. So, you know, all they really want to do is get close to you is what I get. To be honest with you, you know, you see how this lady is so close to the flower? That's how they are. They want to get like this close to you. 
So yeah, this person is definitely, I think it's safe to say, in love with you. Ace of Wands. So if there was a breakup or there was some kind of miscommunication, um, wait no longer. Okay, wait no longer because this person is watching you. Page of Swords. Wow. Maybe in the past they manifested the wrong thing with you. Maybe they manifested more drama than love. But they are watching you. They are definitely watching you. And they want to have a relationship with you. It's it's very clear to me in the cards, okay? Obviously, in a private, I can look into your own individual situation. I'd be more than happy to do that for you. Um, but in terms of this reading, I definitely see there could have been... Yeah, they're definitely watching you. Like, they're they're literally obsessed, okay? It's, it's really hard to deny these cards, like the same cards keep coming out. So yeah, this person's definitely obsessed. But um, I think that you yourself, Virgo, have to decide if you want to go through with this. Um, you know, are the, are the feelings mutual, right? Is the feelings mutual? You know, maybe this person's more in love with you or more attracted to you than you are with them, okay? And nothing nothing's wrong with that. You know, nothing is wrong with that at all. Um, we have Eight of Cups upright. So this is confirming there could have been a walkway. There could have been some kind of separation energy there. But I feel like if you want it to come back together, it will. Like if you want it to, it will, Virgo, okay, is what I want to say to you. Seven of Pentacles, okay. Nine of Cups. And the... Three more, three more for Virgo, please. Yeah, it's a burden, though. Something about this kind of feels creepy or toxic, I want to say. Like, something about it feels kind of strange. Um, maybe you weren't expecting this. You know, maybe this person wasn't expecting that. You know, depending on who's the one who's kind of being stalked here or if you both are stalking each other. Um, like, they weren't expecting this. They weren't expecting, like, all these feelings. Or you weren't expecting this person to have all these feelings for you, but they definitely do. Nine of Cups. You know, you're the wish granted for sure. Wow. Well, one of the best readings of the month. I think this is one of the best readings of the month. Um, for sure. Okay. So the Wheel of Fortunes. Of, oh, I love it. The Lovers. Wow. Okay. So this person's definitely yours. Um, what I'm hearing Spirit say is that if you want this person, they're yours. You don't have to look any further, okay? Because this person, I think, and you have been going through it for a very long time. Um, but this person's still here for you, okay? Even if they come across as like very nonchalant, um, this person in their heart, heart, which is not, you can't see that, you know, it's not like they're talking, but um, yeah, in their heart, they definitely are still there for you. I think that when you post something or you know, if you work together, like they, they definitely look out for you without you knowing is what I get here. Okay. This could be also like a work romance for others of you. This could be like a work romance, like a, a work romance. Yeah, definitely. Definitely. Like at work, you guys are both, you know, flirting and stuff, or this person's trying to like flirt with you or get to know you or look you up. So this person's very interested, like very, very interested. So it's really hard to deny um, their feelings for you. But the question is, you know, do you feel the same? All right. That's your message, Virgo. I think one of the best readings of the month, honestly, I mean, this person's feelings for you are off the charts for sure. All right. I will see you in the next video. Bye.